Hello. In this video, I'm going to teach you how to control patella malalignment using simple K-tip. The tape I'm going to use is a product supplied by Rock Tape, and Rock Tape has many different colors. You can see here, yeah, the cow print and so on. So if you just look at a website and you can find it. So we're going to use two small pieces and on the back of the tip you can see there are motivational comments and things so it's hard to say what size is. On some of the tape you can see they'll have squares so it basically would be four squares as the size I would use. So what we're going to do is let's say for instance a patient has what you believe to be maltracking. Most of the time the muscle on the inside the vastus medialis tends to be atrophied. Not so much in this case because if my model max tenses you can see the VM and the VMO fibers here, okay, which would be the main muscle to control the position of the patella. So if you've got anterior knee pain or a condition called patella femoral pain syndrome, you might find that the VM tends to atrophy, as in waste away, which means the patella has a tendency to, to laterally track, which means that it starts to, to rub behind. So if I turn the patella over, then the area here, these are called the facets. This would be known as the medial facet, this is a lateral facet, and where it contacts the trochlear groove, then if it starts to change its shape because of muscle weakness and muscle overactivation, like the IT band could get involved and so on, then you're gonna get this sort of symptom. So by using a simple piece of taping system, so I'm gonna use two pieces, so the patient, imagine, walks up and down stairs. Downstairs is painful. If I got my model to bend, he might say, yes, I'm aware of pain around the front of the knee. So what I'm going to do is use the two small pieces, turn one over, imagine where the square would be, rip the square, you have a choice. You can either peel it all the way off or just leave it in contact, because if you peel it off, it means you've got to contact the back of the tape. So what I'm going to do is leave it in contact here and apply this. I'm going to think about where the, the IT band comes down here, okay, to the Gerdes tubercle around the lateral ligament is where I'm going to start. I'm going to start at an angle. Okay, you'll see why in a second. So I'm going to stick that down. It sticks quite well to men's hairs, like that. And then what we're going to do is pull it, so then it causes it to lift. Peel it back. Then what I'm going to do is, you won't see me do much of this, but I'm going to tension the tape and pull it over. But at the same time, I'm going to push the patella medially. It's hard to say how much. The good thing is with rock tape, or any form of K-tip has at least a 120, 140% stretch. So I'm gonna stretch this almost like 70, 80%, not 100, okay? And I'm gonna push the patella at the same time. And then as it comes over, I'm gonna ease off a little and just lay that down along that medial side along here. All right, so the idea is, is that it just pushes the patella a little bit. The same on this one. So pull, rip the tape. And if I was just to peel that off to give you an example, if you are going to hold it, hold it right on its edge, try not to touch it too much, apply that around the LCL, head of fibula area, pull so the tape lifts, peel it back, tension the tape, and, get, and use your finger and push the patella whilst pulling the tape around 70, 80%, ease it off, and then lay it down, so it forms like a cross formation. A lot of people find this one quite comfortable to wear because there is another way using a brown tape called a leukotype, which naturally gives more stability, but it can feel a little irritated, whereas with this one, you can leave it on for five days and it works very well. The test would be the patient would now stand and then bend to see if the symptoms would reduce. With the tape on, you can then instigate some vastus medialis exercises, maybe look at control of the glutes as well. So there's a simple K-taping protocol for controlling the patella femoral pain syndrome symptoms. Hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.